Then if you have a logo and a name, you want to register as a trademark. Question is, what do you need to consider and what do you need to do? In this video, I want to talk about that. Let's begin. Hi, my name is Martis. I make daily video about legal, business, and intellectual property. What is intellectual property? Think about copyright, trademark, and other intellectual property. In this video, we're going to talk about trademark, a logo, and a name. I'm going to give you some tips and tricks that you can use. So let's begin. Let's go to the whiteboard. And in the whiteboard, I want to show you the situation. Then I want to give you some tips and tricks that you can use in order to get the most out of the registration. And if you have questions about this, feel free to contact me on Discord, Telegram, or Patreon. If you're new to this channel, feel free to subscribe. I'm not forcing you or anything. It's free. So let's start. Let's go to the whiteboard and then we're going to talk about this. So this is the whiteboard. Let's talk about the situation. So this is you. Sorry for my drawing. Okay. And you have a trademark. Let's say a logo. And let's say, yeah, this is your logo. And what you also have, you also have a name. So you have to things that you want to register as trademark so if you look at it these things are important so these things are really important for us right now but if you look at the trademark office you need to look out what your trademark office is and where can you register the trademark so we have the trademark office here and you need to register your trademark from here to here and you want to register a logo a name or a combination of it so when you go to the office, there's some things that you need to consider. Thing is, first thing first, let's go to, um, let's make an overview. So you see this, if you go to the office, there are three things that are important. First thing is, what do you want to register? Second thing is, did you do the research? Third thing is, what is your budget? Those three things are really important, yeah. Because um, sometimes when you go to the office, when you arrive at the office, you want to register your trademark for one class, but you find out, hey, I need to do for more class. And the thing is to do upfront research. And if you look at this trademark here, there are three options. You can register only the name, you can register only the logo, but you can also register combinations. So we have three three things. We have let's say let's call this one logo two uh, name and three combi combi means combination so if you look at this you have three combination you need to consider which one do you need to register if you do up front on on the uh, if you do up front on uh, research you will know what the best option is and what not I made another video about how you can do uh, some research about trademark, how you can look for a similar trademark in the tra uh, trademark engine. Just look in the playlist of a trademark and you'll find a lot of video about how I display, how I do some research about trademarks and maybe you can use those tips to do your own research. But if you don't have time for that or anything related to that, you can contact me or contact someone else, specialist that can help you. Yeah? with trademark but for now you just need to know if i have a name and a logo and i want to register i need to do upfront research second thing that you need to know second thing that's really important yeah, when you look at trademark you need to figure you need to always keep this in mind so when you look at trademark there's one thing you need to always keep in mind most people forget about that this is your trademark imagine these are all your customers right so this here are all your customers and the thing is what most people forget and I don't blame them but what most people forget is you see here you need to register a trademark that when you communicate with your customer they know this is your trademark do not trademark something and you are not using it and you're not communicate with your customer because on the long run it will be gone that's why I'm saying communication with your customer, their brand is really important. How do you know that? You can do marketing research, but don't waste your time on that. You can also talk to your customers. 
if you have a lot of customers you will know that if you have social media account you could know that you can just look at the analytics put them pull out there see what what they find important you could do research yourself you don't need to hire someone extend to do it for you but you can do it yourself so when you register a trademark or logo and a name it's important to keep those things in mind it's really important and what i always advise people to do is do some research if you have a budget do some research or do your own research if you don't have a budget because it can save a lot of money it can save a lot of time when you register a trademark and you find out that's similar something and you go into the process where you need to do um uh, well, yeah, we need to do some negotiation with the other party or you need to go to court it costs a lot of money and it's a waste of your time so prevent that by doing that so if you like this content and you're interested in more of this content feel free to subscribe if you're new to this channel if you have questions about this contract just go on discord or patreon or telegram and send me a message and i will reply to you if you have other questions let me know in the comment and I will see you in the next video.